Let's start with another tutorial of solid edge. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how solid edge power features can become disconnected from a power model and how to reconnect them. Basically, solid edge are separately associated. This means that each feature of a power model is connected to at least one or another feature. The relationship between the features are sometimes called the parent and child relationship. New features are the child children relationship and they are related to their parent features. If we delete the parent feature, then automatically the children features become disconnected from the path model because they are only relationship. So this tutorial will give you an example. First of all, import the file. By clicking on the next, we have saved this as a new version. So this is the Pathfinder in the workspace. Under this tree, we will know how this path has been made. So by clicking on the Pathfinder display, click check all the options so that plain sketches construction coordinate system reference axis has been shown. By clicking on next, review how the path has been made. First of all, Provision 1 for this a circle circle profile extended upward to form a large cylinder. Then a circle profile is extended downward to form the bottom cylinder. Then a hole is created in the base. Then a sketch is used to cut out one and another sketch is used to cut out two to create this hole of the slot. So by clicking on the feature playback button, we will see how the part has been created. So, first of all, this cut out and then this cut out. So, by clicking on next, we will hide this sketch one. By clicking that. Now, we want to create this cut out in the part. On the feature to the click on the cut out, select the plane. Put in the part, then click on next. Actually, we want to create this circle under this dimension. So, this dimension circle should be of 30 millimeter diameter. See. Now click on dimension button. Should be two hundred. This distance should be fifty. So by clicking on next, go to return button. We want to create a hole on symmetric extent. Click on finish. Now we want to create another. So for this, edit the sketch. So on the feature toolbar, we want to edit the sketch. Click on the construction display button. Click on the sketches. Show all the sectors. Click on apply. Okay, oh, sketches has been shown now. Click on the select tool, select the sketch as shown. Now, click on the ribbon bar and edit the click on the edit definition button. This activates the smart step ribbon for the sketch feature. So, Now go to next. As you can see, all the dimension has been shown. So we want to edit the dimension. So position the cursor about 200 millimeter from the center line to base of the cylinder. So if we select this dimension, enter a new value of instead of 200, enter a value of 100 millimeter. Enter. Click on next. 
click on finish the cut out constructed at the beginning of this tutorial is no longer displayed so on the feature pathfinder tab in the edge bar the field feature symbol is displayed adjacent to the this is the field feature it means this cutout feature is no longer available so now on the main toolbar click the error assistant button on the main toolbar now click on the error assistant button so next you can see in status is field profile the error in profile does not generate a valid path no material is removed so here is the corrective action to fix this profile if you need to adjust the profile so it is intersect the model so all this reason and corrective action has been written here so click the edit and I'll click the edit profile button so here you can see from the no and delete them so delete the dimension now click on next so now click on the concentric the circle and on the arc this you can see the circle is concentric with this arc now click on the return button to next click on the finish now you can see the corrective action has been taken and we reconnect the feature uh, that creates the error so save this file so this is all about this tutorial